hi guys welcome back to the youtube channel i'm so excited that you're here i have a new video out and i'm most suddenly sure that you're gonna love this a few weeks ago i uploaded a video about how to create and upload your react app on any as in mark my words any web hosting platform okay but then in that video i didn't really give a deeper understanding a deeper explanation i just uploaded a video hoping that everybody would see how things are uploaded but today today mark my words today i have a deeper explanation about how things work and why you should do certain things the way i'm gonna show you without further ado let's get into it before we go any further please spare one second just one second to support my channel by subscribing liking and commenting what you think about the video i would really appreciate any feedback from you because this helps the channel grow my dream while i was still in college until now has been always to aspire other new developers and by doing so i share content like this i build projects live stream them and then share the repositories free for free of charge to anybody who is interested on my github account okay i share the source code so you can download the source code improve the project that I've worked on, then list it on your resume as your own. How better can that be? But today we're not gonna get into the gossip. Let's see how to upload a React app anywhere platform. As you can see right now, I've already created the app. It's already running. I just need to start the server and then get into the next steps, the most crucial steps. Okay, if you want, if you're curious on about how to create your first React app, please just go ahead and go into my React playlist. I created a playlist that you can go from part one until this part to make sure you are well advanced about what we're talking about. The first thing we are going to do is run the server. Okay, and how do we run the server? Just with simply typing in PM that but before all that always always make sure that you are in the directory of your react app i named my react app host app most times when you're in the folder if you type npx create react app it's gonna create a directory all right always change directory to that app and then that will serve okay And our server should be running right now. So since our server is running right now, I'm just going to copy and paste the server side URL so it can run in the background because it was opening in another browser and yet I wanted you guys to see in this browser. Okay. So I'm just going to go ahead and clear that. Then what I will do, um, just take note of what's going to happen. This is step number two. The first step is to run the server. All right. Our app is right there. To show you that this is running live, I'll go ahead. Um, you can see how that, how fast <laughs> that server really is reloading before even just tapping any command save okay so the next thing step number two so here you can go ahead and improve your react app do whatever you want with it so the next thing you're gonna do step number two is run npm actually i'm in bash and that's not i'll just turn over to z sh it doesn't matter what browser you uh what terminal you use and then I'll run build. Take note of what's happening here. Okay. Like I said, make sure you are in the 
directory. There we go. npm run build. There we go. Perfecto. Take note of that. So this is a crucial, crucial folder that we need for the day. After this, that's it. Okay. So step number three. Step number three. You can see right now that a new folder was created. A complex. Oh, sorry. This was from previously when I was testing out everything. So this is the new folder that was created. So step number three compress this uh folder that's all we need right put that aside step number four create a subdomain or a domain i've already created my domain and in my host uh web hosting platform so um i'll use a subdomain because this is a test project and my subdomain will be that so if you need help right now if you visit this subdomain there is nothing all right so we're gonna make we're gonna make it active what we're gonna do is to upload files into this subdomain all right so grab that and i know you must be wondering why am i using zipped files because some web hosting platforms do not understand folders but they like um files all right that's why we compressed that into a file into a zipped file step number four are we in step number four i guess so is to extract these files okay so just go ahead and extract them in the same directory step number five we don't need all this junk step number six get into the directory uh the folder you just uploaded select all vids okay Uh, select all these files. Maybe not that. Okay, maybe and not that. And not that either. Okay, we simply need the index.html and then we are gonna move it a folder or a path backwards. So this run, the folder we uploaded has only this. Our interest is just to get the HTML just directly under our subdomain. That way, whenever somebody visits you, that URL, they are immediately led in onto, immediately led onto the index HTML. Step number six or seven, I guess you're counting. Delete all the stuff we don't need and step number eight refresh this and our app is live okay so congratulations voila you just uploaded your react app on any and this works for any any web hosting platform right so if you think this video was helpful please consider subscribing if you think it wasn't helpful comment and let me know what happened what went wrong where are you facing a challenge also do not forget to subscribe to the channel we are growing the channel is growing the community is growing i just created tiktok a tiktok channel i just created um uh, we've been on instagram for quite a while follow us you know subscribe uh, follow us follow us on twitter send in your messages i'm really excited to read all your messages i love seeing you build projects so 
and I, I'm open to contributing as well. If you need me to contribute to any project that you're working on, I'm open. Hit me up. Let's talk. All right. I love meeting new people. So let's get the community growing. My dream has always been to help other developers, aspire other developers grow. And that's how I share every knowledge that I have. If you want any other explanation about how to do anything in react please consider going to the react playlist i have a html playlist i also got a css playlist and soon we are unveiling a javascript and a python playlist so you do not want to miss out this so please consider subscribing and hit the bell icon that way you are notified whenever i upload something interesting remember do not stress too much you can do this